Yo, and welcome to another video, an actual video, and a video I promised that I'd make for when this update came. Since then, I calmed the hell down on the fact that these people, Ubisoft, they did the worst thing that could ever imagine, and that one thing is to not fix the rap editor to its entirety. Isn't that beautiful? I honestly felt like it was not going to get fixed. I knew it wasn't going to get fixed because this is Ubisoft we're talking about. And Ubisoft has been making some dumbass decisions lately. So, it's like I'm not surprised that they didn't fix this rap editor completely. But I'm also disappointed that they did this because of the fact that they fixed one glitch that's been in the game since release which i don't which i mean i'm gonna get into that later but anyway yeah the rap editor still bugged the hell for me and for whoever else has this same exact glitch as me i know i'm not the only one there's no way i'm the only one in the entire world that has this problem and now i'm probably gonna have to wait another four to five months just for them to not fix it again so yeah basically i'm just tired of it now i'm gonna go ahead and show you what it looks like I don't even know if I did show it before but if I didn't we'll hear it go and I'm gonna I'm just gonna go ahead and just show how triggered I really was all right so I'm gonna go ahead and show you just what I'm talking about about the rap editor just being still broken even after this update now obviously I'm talking about the fact that I can't see any of my fucking decals when I put them on the car no matter what decal it is, even a custom decal, still can't see it. And I'm about to show you just how that shit works. And just how broken and tedious it is if you even try to make a rap with this glitch. Period. This shit is literally so painful and annoying to deal with. It's like, nah, bro. I'm, there's no way I'm even going to put the effort to do this. Now watch. See? It's not on the car, right? Now, you're probably thinking, oh, maybe it's because I ain't picked the color yet. No. <laughs> Even if you don't pick the color, it's still supposed to show up regardless because it already has the same color. Black. No. See? Still can't see it. But you can see that it's moving around. Well, you, can, you can't see the actual decal moving, but you can see the placement for it is moving, which means it's moving, but you can't see it. Which means you can't tell where the fuck is actually going to be at. The, the placement is way different to the actual decal. It'll look like it'll look something completely different than the actual decal. So you'll be thinking it's placed like. Let me see. For some reason, I can't even fucking. I don't know. Because. It does. It doesn't even show you when it's rotating. So yeah, like that. And then you have to hit modify material, and you see it pop up, right? But you gonna see some way more stupid as soon as it. That's that's also another glitch too. That's that's also how you know this shit is still on here because it takes forever to even go to change material, and then when you back out, it takes forever to back out too. So. You see, standard is basically being close. It's still met. Even when I, even when I change it, still met. I'm trying to. I'm doing as many angles as possible just to show you. Like metallic, it's still met. Chrome, it's still met. Anodized, still met. Now, you see how it's still on the car, right? Because after I did that. Now, watch this. Different placement, and it still sit there. Confirm. You can't even see where it's actually at. Because you have to hit change material again. And then, I don't know if it's actually going to change the material. So, well, no, it's not going to change the material. Matter of fact, let me go ahead and pick Chrome again. It doesn't change its material. It stays that it stays as is, even when you go back into it. 
can see this, it's still matte. Now you probably think, oh, maybe it just looks matte because you ain't got it to where the angle can pick it up. Oh, trust me. I can. T I will be able to tell if something is a different material regardless of its, you know, spot. Now, some spot maybe, but I can still tell if it's a different material. It didn't change material. It didn't. You know, adding another decal still does the same thing. You have to do this for every single decal you put on the fucking car. And even that, you still can't even get a good pinpoint on where it's actually landing for real. You can't even tell when you're, re when you're rotating the decal because it doesn't show the actual rotation on the placement. It just shows the placement enlarging maybe. I don't fucking know. Now. Custom decals, see, now you can now just scroll through them at ease, no problems, even with custom decals, still can't even see where the fuck is it until you click change material, and you have to do that for every single decal you put on the car, and then you still have to hope that you know where it's at, to, you know what I'm saying, it's just way too much, bro. Like, it makes no sense why this glitch is still here when it's supposed to have been fixed to begin with. And, yeah. Ubisoft are just lazy bastards. They're just lazy as hell. They could have been fixed this problem, honestly. But, because they didn't want to. I just simply don't care about the game no more. Like, I'm not even going to touch the game no more. Even with the fact that, you know, my car is actually finally, at least some of them, are finally transferring over, I'm still not going to touch the game because if they can't even fix the rap editor and I paid how much money for this game, nigga, ain't no way I'm about to sit here and waste my time. Basically, I ain't get fixed. This is, no, I'm going to tell you what happened. See, this glitch isn't just like a glitch that been in the game since day one like that one was. With the custom decals and you couldn't pick your own custom decals and you had to constantly apply, delete, save, and then repeat all over again just to get the decals that you wanted but you couldn't because you literally had to do that process over and over and over again just to get to it. Basically, this glitch, I think this glitch is the result of that retarded puny goofy ass maintenance update they did that one time where it required the whole servers for the game to be down to do it and that shit is disappointing as hell because like i said i've waited but i've waited like what three four five months i don't even fucking know how long it took like three four I don't know. It took it took more than one month. I'm gonna just say that it took more. It took more than one month that I had to wait for this to even happen. And honestly, even right now, I'm not even excited for the fucking Hoonigan update because I can't put a rap on the fucking cars. Considering that I can't make raps because it is glitch. Like I'm not gonna lie to you. It is it is the most painful thing for me like the, it is the only thing that was mattering to me like i didn't really care much about the hoonigan update yeah that fucking truck spicy as hell sexy as hell but it would have been better if i was able to put a wrap on it you know what i'm saying it would have been better if i could put a, <laughs> put some decals on me but ubisoft saying no we're not gonna do shit and i'm just tired of it like I waited so many months for them to just not do jack shit. Like I said, if they wasn't going to fix the rap editor to its entirety, and when I mean my to its entirety, I mean every single glitch that existed on there, which didn't obviously ain't work, I was not going I was not even going to put all my hours again on Motorfest. I wish that I already had put in. Like I put in so many hours on Motorfest from release up until a certain point where I just stopped giving a fuck because there is no good multiplayer. Grand Race is not a good multiplayer to me. This it's just Battle Royale 2.0. It's it's literally Battle Royale 2.0. And the reason why I say that is because there is a Battle Royale mode for the game. So it's quite literally Battle Royale 2.0. The only difference is you can't kill each other. The only thing you can do is really race and you just you know murder people in corners during the process just to take a position and you know i'm just tired of it bro like 
I'm I'm already sick of the fact that games are just lacking nowadays, but having just crazy price tags, and it just makes no fucking sense. Seventy dollar price tag for a standard edition game, terrible. And just batting up that motherfucker CEO at fucking Rockstar Games and trying to fucking make it a system where you're going to get charged what how many hours after you you know play like if you play so long of a of gta 6 that you're gonna get charged a certain amount to continue playing or you won't be able to play until the next day or whatever the fuck it's bad enough that they already trying to implement a system like that so if they actually succeed gaming will forever be dead at that point nobody and i mean nobody other than motherfuckers that got m's b's t's g's and all and all in the alphabet in their bank account to do that you know what i'm saying and, it's, and not to mention that they already trying to they already thinking about making their game just way more expensive than what all the other games is going for right now 70 dollars standard edition you know i can only imagine a standard edition of gta 6 with that mindset that motherfuckers is going through it's quite literally gonna be 80 to ninety dollars standard edition. You think I'm lying? Just watch what happens. If it happens, just watch. Just watch that price tag go from seventy to ninety dollars. I've been patiently waiting for these motherfuckers to hopefully do the right thing and fix the rap editor completely. You know what I'm saying? Like this glitch came around when they was doing that goofy ass maintenance for the game. And ever since then, I couldn't. Ne I can never use a decal on a car, even when I try to make it show. Because don't shit happen. It's just it's just broken. It's broken, and it irritates me. Like don't get me wrong. I I like playing the game. I like racing and shit. Really, my actual you know soul for Motorfest or just the crew in general is really just making raps for real. And not and since I can't make a single damn rap on the game because a glitch that they still haven't fixed after how long of this game being out. Of them basically neglecting a day one patch, stupid as hell, and a, even a mid update, well, the fuck that puny ass update was, that ain't that ain't do shit because it wasn't even meant to fix that. It was meant to fix shit that still was broken and probably is still broken to this day. Like it is, it is this a shame. And I already know people gonna try to come out the woodworks talking about some. Oh, you just you just don't like the game. Well, you just you just talking bad about the game because eh, it's just the one thing that you care about and everybody else don't care. But trust me, bro. Like I said, I'm not the only one that has this glitch. Guaranteed, there's more than one motherfucker other than me that has this glitch. And I'm pretty sure I'm there feeling the same way as me right now. Where they basically had to wait so long just for them to not even fix the fucking rap editor completely like they should have. Even if they fixed the the one rap, the one glitch for the custom decals. Even if they had fixed that on day one. Like they had supposed to have done and shit. And then that glitch came out of nowhere and happened. Guess what? It would have been fixed. Because it would have been the only thing. It really would have been the only glitch that would have been aware of. And people would have been talking about it. But because that glitch came out. And it still had the custom decal glitch. The, the custom decal glitch. That's been in the game since day one of release. Even in the, in the early access when you pre-ordered the game. I think depending on whatever it is. It don't matter. It's been there for it been there since day one. And the shit ain't get fixed. And now I'm just tired of it, bro. I'm not like the only thing I'm gonna be doing at Motorfest at this point is just getting cards that I can't get with in game currency because I refuse to put any more hours in this game in terms of my, you know, personal hours. Like hours that I would gladly put in because I want to play the game. No, I'm only going to be... These are just going to be hours I'm putting in. Just to get cards that I can't get. For example, shit that's in the Summit. You know, the Magma Edition. I don't have that card. And guess what? Since it is in the Summit of Motorfest, I'm going to do it. Why? Because I want that damn card. And I don't have it. Of course, it's not going to transfer to the crew too. Because that's just not how it works way. But I still want the card. And maybe they actually get off their ass and fix it. Probably tomorrow, you know what I'm saying? Maybe, maybe I'm just tripping, and they and they're actually gonna fix it tomorrow.
If only it was really true. Like, I know they ain't gonna do that shit. These motherfuckers waited three to four months to not fix jack shit on the rap editor. So, me hoping that they gonna fix it any sooner as tomorrow, as tomorrow, it's not gonna happen. Like, these motherfuckers are more, are more lazy than... Hold up. No, actually, I don't even think I can compare them to how lazy they are, for real. I think these motherfuckers are just that lazy at this point. Like, they, they're really just that lazy because ain't no way you sitting here letting this shit slide and think I'm and think people like me is just going to sit here and just stick with the fact that the rap editor is still broken. So, still have to ride around with default looking ass cars with nothing but color on them or if they're a special kind of car that can't even have colors changed on them. And they just going to be basically boneless like boneless pizza you know what i'm saying like boneless pizza they're just boneless pieces boneless ain't nothing good about it you know what i'm saying i'm just i'm just done at this point i refuse to put you know worthwhile hours in the game anymore until they fix this shit and if they don't fix it all the way to whenever the next crew came and gets announced and released I'm not even going to buy the next crew game because now I know I can't trust these motherfuckers to even fix their own game when they should. It's bad enough I had to wait that long to even get a glitch fixed and still have to deal with one that's been way worse than that one. So, yeah. To the people that are waiting for me to, you know, make more Tekko Deco, well, not Tekko Deco, Tekko Raps on the game, even though I already made some before, and sadly, I can't really make any more, and nor at least fix one that is quite frankly going through some turmoil, because I think it's I think it's still bugged. I have to look at it again. I, if I if I can find like if it's still bugged, I'm probably gonna throw it in. I'm probably gonna throw it in the video show you what I'm talking about. But other than that, yeah, I'm just not gonna be making raps on the game and i'm not gonna put my worthwhile hours in the game that i will gladly dedicate to like i'm not doing it the, 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 these are just i'm just gonna be playing the game just to get cars i can't buy with the in-game currency just regular in-game currency like if i can't get it with regular in-game currency or anything like that and i have to you know do shit to get the car like a summit and stuff like that or playlist i'm not going i'm not i'm i'm not gonna put time in the game you know what i'm saying I'm, I'm just gonna go for the cars and that's it i'm not even gonna do nothing for the vanity items unless it's a specific vanity item that's in there that i fuck with heavy did i really want then that's different other than that all the other vanities are just lacking anyway because it's just repeats of vanities that already exist either in the crew too and you are and already have them or they just exist from so many months ago of motorfest that's not in the crew too. This also means that I can also just focus completely on the takeo raps that's for the crew too only. Because since Ubisoft can't really get off their ass and you know fix the game that should have been fixed since day one of release, as I said, I can just focus all my time on the takeo raps that I'm doing for you know PlayStation and PC for the crew too. And I can just call it then when it's time to show all of them and to have them ready. You know what I'm saying? And I'm going to try to make this one as spicy as I can. You know what I'm saying? If I can't, like, if I can, I'm going to try to make it as spicy as possible. So, yeah. Other than that, that's about it. And I'll catch y'all later. <laughs>